Hello everybody, this is PenMD and today we are going to be looking at the pen from the Japan ma Japanese manufacturer Platinum. The pen is quest in question is 3776 in Chartres Blue color. So, uh, the pen is, uh, as you can see, it's very very glossy. It's, uh, it's, it's in blue, in transparent blue. I don't know if you can see it correctly you can see there that it is uh, transparent blue semi-transparent basically the nib on the pen is 14 14 karat gold 14 karat gold nib a six size nib and it has a very nice fit on the back of the nib section is rather rather small but comfortable and uh, the frets are a bit sharp, but I, I don't find a problem with that. The pen is cartridge converter pen. It doesn't come with a, uh, with a converter and you have to buy it separately. And the converter is, uh, I think, only in uh, gold. So if you have a silver version of, of the 3776, it may be a little problematic for you. Uh, the nib is uh, fine and uh, as you probably know the Japanese fines are writing like a, a extra fines uh, from any other country. So the pen, the pen is made out of plastic and uh, it, the, oh, the whole body of the pen is, is plastic apart from the little part here and of course the clip and rings but basically it's a very good kind of plastic it doesn't feel cheap it feels uh, very very good in the hand uh, it, and there is no problem with the material of the pen but it tends to scratch itself from uh, everyday using the pen the the clip of a pen is sturdy it's very nice, it's uh, uh, inserted in a, in a good way and it feels um, very uh, very hard and, and durable but the end of uh, the gold is wearing off out of the top side of the clip right here at the angle I don't know if you can see it it's hard to see uh, basically, but uh, it does. It, the, the gold is wearing off, uh, the gold plating is wearing off out of the angle of a clip. The pen has a um, patented uh, platinum uh, uh, slip and seal mechanism, which makes the nib uh, wet for up to two years, I believe. And uh, it's, it's guaranteed that uh, it won't uh, get dry uh, and you have all... Uh, the pen is always, always ready for, uh, for action. <laughs> the pen is always... The, the pen is very, very good and it, uh, it doesn't stop or something like that. You, have to, you don't have to push the, the, uh, the converter to get the ink flow start. Uh, it's a very very good uh, pen, but it gets um, it gets scratched from the uh, posting, uh, and and the posting of a of a pen is is uh, is very very good. It posts deeply, securely, and uh, you have to post it if you want to write a little uh, longer because the pen is rather small. And now we're gonna uh, now we're gonna measure the pen. The pen is a uh, 13.8 centimeters when it's capped. When it's uh, uncapped, it's uh, 11.9. And posted, it is, is 15.3 centimeters. Uh, the weight of a pen, capped or posted, is 25 grams, and when it's uncapped, 
uh, it's 15 so the cap is 10 grams on itself so we're gonna start a writing sample I'm gonna zoom in a little, a little bit so the pen is platinum 3776 it's in in blue i don't know if i if i spell it correct correctly but but it's 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 french word i don't know so uh, it is a gold 14 carat a fine Nip. The ink that I'm using is Waterman Blue and I think you can hear that that the nib has a lot of feedback it doesn't scratch but it has a very very uh, a large amount of feedback it is uh, it uh, it sounds like it is scratchy maybe a little bit but basically it has a lot of feedback I like it and I don't uh, have a problem with that but if you like your pens very very uh, smooth and quiet it may be a problem maybe a, 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 big, a big problem uh, so uh, the the nib doesn't have a the, I, I really don't want to bend it it, it doesn't it doesn't uh, it doesn't um, uh, make the uh, the line broader when you when you uh, uh, when you push on the nib the nib is is slightly bending when I when I when I push on it but it doesn't make the, the the line very very broader and I don't want to bend the nib because it's it's rather rigid it's rather rigid uh, nib so thank you very much and uh, I'll be seeing you in another video thank you very much bye